Have you ever wondered about the bustling city beneath the ocean waves? It's a world that's as diverse and vibrant as any on land, an ecosystem teeming with life in every conceivable shape, size, and color. Welcome to the Coral Reef, a true wonder of the natural world, and indeed the most biodiverse ecosystem on our planet. Its intricate formations are a testament to the wonders of evolution, with every nook and cranny providing a home for some creature or another. From the smallest microorganism to the largest fish, each plays a crucial role in the grand scheme of this underwater paradise. Our journey today isn't just a casual swim through the depths, it's an exploration, a voyage of discovery. We'll uncover the secrets of survival, the nuances of symbiosis, and the delicate dance of life that takes place beneath the waves. So, if you're ready to dive in, let's explore the mesmerizing world of the coral reef. The backbone of this underwater city is its corals. Picture a world of vibrant hues and varied shapes and you've just begun to scratch the surface of the coral reef's diversity. But these intricate formations are not merely inanimate rocks, they are bustling metropolises of countless microorganisms forming a living, breathing entity. Corals are fascinating creatures that come in a myriad of forms, each with its unique role in the ecosystem. Branching corals with their finger-like projections reach out into the water, forming dense thickets that provide shelter for a multitude of marine creatures. They are the high-rise apartments of the underwater world, providing homes for countless species. Then there are the massive brain corals, their labyrinthine surface resembling the complex folds of a brain. These grand structures can live for hundreds of years, growing slowly but steadily inch by inch. They are the elders of the reef, witnessing the ebb and flow of life over centuries. And don't forget the delicate sea fans, their thin, leaf-like structures waving gently in the current. These corals are the artists of the reef, their intricate designs adding a touch of elegance to the underwater landscape. But corals are more than just beautiful. They are the very foundation of the reef, creating an environment that supports a dazzling array of marine life. Each coral species serves as a habitat, a food source, or a breeding ground for various marine creatures, contributing to the overall biodiversity of the reef. And yet, despite their seeming permanence, corals are incredibly fragile. Each polyp, the tiny organism that makes up a coral is a delicate balance of life, dependent on clean water, sunlight, and the right temperature to survive and thrive. From branching corals to brain corals to sea fans, each type of coral adds a unique piece to the reef's intricate puzzle. They are the builders, the nurturers, and the protectors of this underwater paradise. These corals, in all their variety, are the architects of the reef. But the corals are not alone. In this vibrant, colorful world beneath the waves, a rich array of marine life has found a home within the coral reef's intricate formations. Each species, from the smallest crustacean to the most majestic fish, adds a unique thread to the complex tapestry of life that makes up this underwater paradise. Imagine, if you will, a bustling metropolis alive with activity around the clock. Now cast this image beneath the waves, and you have the coral reef. Like the city's residents, each creature in the reef has a role to play. The tropical fish darting between corals are not unlike the city's commuters going about their daily routines. The crustaceans, with their hard exoskeletons, are the builders and cleaners maintaining the structure and health of the reef. Then there are the mollusks with their dazzling array of shapes and colors, from the intricate spirals of the nautilus to the iridescent hues of the giant clam. These are the artists of the reef, adding a touch of beauty to an already stunning landscape. And let's not forget the stealthy predators, the sharks and barracudas, maintaining balance in this underwater ecosystem, just as law enforcement does in our cities. But this is more than just a city. It's a symphony. Each organism, each interaction, is a note in the grand composition of life. And like any symphony, the coral reef requires harmony. Every creature, from the microscopic plankton to the towering coral formations, plays a part in maintaining this balance, this harmony, yet it's not all about survival. There's also a sense of community, of belonging. From the symbiotic relationships between clownfish and anemones to the mutualistic partnerships between cleaner shrimp and groupers, the reef is a testament to cooperation and coexistence. This bustling city is home to a variety of marine life, each playing their part in the ecosystem. And just like our cities, the coral reef is a place of constant change, a place where life thrives against the odds, creating a spectacle of color and movement that is as mesmerizing as it is inspiring. In this underwater city, 
Every organism has a role to play. The coral reef ecosystem is a bustling metropolis of life, where every creature from the tiniest plankton to the most massive shark has a part in maintaining the balance of this delicate system. Consider the fascinating relationship between coral polyps and zoxanthellae, a type of algae. These tiny algae live inside the coral's tissue in a perfect example of mutualistic symbiosis. The coral provides a secure home for the zooxanthellae, while the algae produce food through photosynthesis, which feeds the coral. Together, they create the vibrant colors that make coral reefs a spectacle of nature. Then there are cleaner fish, which offer a cleaning service to larger marine creatures. They remove parasites, dead skin, and other debris from their clients, getting a meal in the process. This partnership benefits both parties and contributes to the overall health of the reef. But life on the reef isn't all cooperation. Predation is a significant part of the ecosystem dynamics. The graceful movements of lionfish, for instance, belie their role as efficient predators. These striking fish hunt smaller creatures, keeping populations in check and preventing any one species from dominating the ecosystem. Competition is another aspect of life on the reef. Space is a valuable commodity in these densely populated underwater cities. Corals compete with each other for prime real estate, extending their polyps to wage slow-motion battles for territory. It's a delicate balance of mutualism, predation, and competition. A disruption in one part of this intricate system can send ripples throughout the entire ecosystem. A decline in cleaner fish, for instance, could lead to an increase in parasites and disease, affecting the health of the entire reef. The coral reef is a complex web of life where every organism depends on another for survival. It's a beautiful testament to the interconnectedness of life on our planet, a subtle reminder that we're all part of a larger whole. The dynamics of this ecosystem are a delicate dance, a ballet of biology that plays out beneath the waves. But this underwater paradise is under threat. Even as we marvel at the breathtaking beauty and intricate dynamics of the coral reef ecosystem, we must acknowledge the dire challenges it faces. From climate change to ocean acidification, pollution to overfishing, the threats to these underwater cities are as diverse as the organisms that inhabit them. Climate change, with its rising temperatures and unpredictable weather patterns, poses a significant threat to the delicate balance of coral reef ecosystems. Warmer ocean temperatures can lead to coral bleaching events, in which corals expel the symbiotic algae living in their tissues, causing them to turn white. Without these algae, corals struggle to survive. Ocean acidification, another consequence of our carbon emissions, also threatens coral reefs. As the ocean absorbs more carbon dioxide, its pH decreases, making it more acidic. This acidification hinders the ability of corals to build their calcium carbonate skeletons, slowing their growth and making them more susceptible to damage. Pollution, too, is a major threat to coral reefs. From plastic waste to chemical runoff, our actions on land can have devastating impacts on these underwater ecosystems. These pollutants can smother corals, block sunlight, and introduce harmful substances into the water, disrupting the intricate relationships among reef organisms. Overfishing is another significant challenge, disrupting the delicate balance of predator and prey, and reducing the biodiversity of the reef. It can lead to the overgrowth of algae, which competes with corals for space, light, and nutrients. But there's hope. Conservation efforts around the globe are working to protect and restore these fragile ecosystems. Marine protected areas are being established to limit human activities and give coral reefs a chance to recover. Restoration projects are growing and replanting corals. Scientists are researching ways to make corals more resilient to climate change and acidification. And education initiatives are raising awareness about the importance of coral reefs and what we can do to help. It's up to us to protect and preserve these underwater cities for future generations. Let's rise to that challenge for the sake of the coral reefs and the incredible diversity of life they support. Coral reefs are not just beautiful, they're vital to our survival. These underwater ecosystems are deeply woven into the fabric of human life. They provide a source of income for millions of people across the globe, from fishermen who rely on the abundant sea life they shelter, to tourism operators who share their beauty with the world. Coral reefs also play a crucial role in our cultural heritage, inspiring countless pieces of art, literature, and folklore, and are integral to the identity of coastal communities. Beyond their aesthetic value and cultural significance, these ecosystems serve as natural breakwaters, protecting our coastlines from storm surge and erosion. However, our relationship with coral reefs must be sustainable. Overfishing, pollution, and climate change are all human-induced threats that we must mitigate. 
we need to adopt sustainable practices not just for the sake of the reefs, but for our own survival too. So next time you see a coral reef, remember it's not just a beautiful sight, it's a vital part of our world.